is a quick tutorial on how to install liveries into PCD but um, the same sort of concept applies to FSX anyway so you just follow the same instructions so we'll open up the file this will be in the description link I need to extract these two the readme and the texture file in your version so you have these two and your texture folder here you simply just cut that or copy it go to your P3D folder sim objects airplanes and in order to find out which one it is go to the readme you see it's the dash 200 model so you just go to the similar to passenger here you can just paste it here so that's one of the textures and you go to your aircraft config and open up the readme now this you need to copy it here well first you can check see the numbers here you got one two and so on three four that means the next one will be five because the previous is four so here you can just change it to five and then copy the whole thing paste it here so leave one gap and paste it and save that you can just get rid of these nope as long as you have configs uh, like this now you can clear everything and open up P3D so now P3D is loaded you can uh, go to the vehicle type in 757 and your livery will be there see Thomas Cook 75 if we open it up you can see everything the same so everything loading so you see here cockpit's in then if we go to the external view Okay, I guess my easy duck views are messed up, but anyway, you can see. There you go. Your Thomas Cook livery is installed. And this works with any sort of file, just go to AvSim, type in your livery you want, download it. The files will be exactly the same, just the uh, config will be different. And the procedures are uh, exactly the same to install them, so. Thank you for watching. If you got any other requests, the type of videos you want to see, then just let me know in the comments and. I'll try to do them.